Okay, welcome back to Zebra Nation Plays Football Manager 2016. Get my mic in the right spot. There we go. Uh, Toronto edition. Uh, season 15 again. And we got an interesting game here. This is a friendly for Toronto FC in the middle of the season. I don't remember scheduling this, but here it is nonetheless. Against Bochum. I guess of the third German division so that's interesting uh, did not plan on playing these guys but hey third in German first division okay so there we go that's a little better that's a little more on our level if not higher than our level I have no idea where those stack up I just sort of assume uh, let's look at their team we know what our team's all about so I can consider this sort of a warm-up for the Champions League that we're going to be playing in. And uh, yeah, these guys are pretty good. They're comparable, if not a little better than our team. Especially goalkeeper, they got a big, they got a big advantage goalkeeper-wise. But uh, other than that, you know, they're not that much better than we are. We can hang with these fellas. Running the old 442. Here's our team. I mean, we're all healthy, so I guess we'll play our starters. Our schedule is wide open. We don't play again until the 28th, so there's no reason not to play our starters here. Uh, looks like we can have 12 subs now, so that's good. Let's bring in... Should have set this up before I started recording, but hey. But, hey. Honestly, who cares? Uh, da -da 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 -da, where is... Do I already have Noble? Okay, Noble's already up there. Um, Kim hasn't played in a while. He's sort of lacking some match experience. And then uh, Jordan. Bring him up there. We got all kinds of all kinds of stuff happening here. So let's see, we have most of our starters already in. Sweeney, bring him in. Um, I would like to get Kim some PT. So there, we'll put him in. Mamadou is fine. Good stuff. All right, let's go, let's go. Okay. Start the match. This is uh, an interesting match. I don't have much to say about these guys. Other than this is sort of a litmus test to see where we're at uh, in the world. See if we could win the German first division. I mean, if we can beat these guys, they're third. We, can, we could win that division. Uh, two evenly matched teams. Okay. Fine and dandy. Fine and dandy. We all know what's happening here. They're sticking with the 442. We got uh, Olympic volleyball on the TV right now. Grudge match Brazil and Argentina. Do, do. Come on now. We know how to do this. No, no, no. I think we owe we owe this German team some payback for what their national team did to us. <clears throat> Since we got a lot of the same players, show them what we what we're made of. This is your chance to impress me with no, that's not good. Assertively. Uh, 
Come on, guys. Show everyone what you can do. That's the best I could find. There we go. A couple of motivated guys. That's good. It's really hot. I'm, like, sweating like a pig right now. Got to uh, turn off the fan to record. You know how that goes. So you get, get all hot and bothered. Hmm. Well, that wasn't a good start. Just sort of gone right into back and forth mode. Looks like we got the possession battles, though. If I'm reading that right, which I am probably not. Here we go. We're at, we're at their home stadium, so we made the trip all the way to Germany in the middle of our MLS season. Who scheduled this? All right, let's get organized here. Let's. What are our instructions anyway? Okay, let's go wider. Feel like they're uh, they're susceptible. Ooh, that was interesting. That was interesting. They could be susceptible up the middle too if people would stay on side. I'm looking at you, Kim. Well, that was a dangerous pass. Boom. No, that was awful shot, Mamadou. Didn't get anything on that. Well, we've uh, been looking at the Canadian team, the youngsters, and it's not looking promising, quite frankly. Don't have a ton of uh, potential. And um, we've only got two years to get ready for the World Cup. So I don't know if all of our young guys are going to be ready for that business. I don't even know how to how to go about coaching the under 23s honestly because i think they have a yeah i'm pretty sure i hired a coach for them so i think he just does everything like do i have to fire him if i want to coach the under 23s i don't know how that works so i might miss out on the olympics completely but we'll cross that bridge when we come to it right right yeah well, we are not doing anything here. Now they've got all the control. No highlights to speak of at all. This is uh, kind of boring here. Figure out what to have for dinner. Pop-tarts just aren't holding me. Uh, don't have much in the house. I'll probably have to go out. I don't like going out anymore, though. It's uh, not healthy enough. Gotta watch myself. Be fit like one of these players here. Alright, let's, uh, there it is. Ouch, that's a penalty, come on. McCarthy buries it in the back of the net. I really wish I could have had that guy for Team Canada, but that's one of the guys that the Team USA stole from me. Well, I tried to steal it from them, and they stole it back. So, I guess that's fair, but still. I don't like it. Their goaltender tried to come out and got caught in no man's land there. So, there we go. I mean, we basically just won the German first division. I mean, no doubt about that. If, then, statement. If we beat these guys, then we are the best team in Germany. I'm pretty sure that's how that works. Hmm. Maybe I should work the ball into the box. They seem susceptible to that. Boy, Nave is already tired. At halftime, he's going to have to be our first sub out. Let's see if he can. Make it to the 60 minute mark. I'm pleased with how things are going. Keep it up. Boom. Alright. Back to the action or lack thereof. 
At least it's kind of been going fast. With no highlights to speak of. Other than our one goal, of course. Mm. Let's get a little control here. They're, they're kind of wide open there in the middle. We're spreading them out. We're spreading them out here. Treo needs to make a move. Can't hold on to the ball like that, buddy. Fisher, what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, man. Just seems like they're missing opportunities left and right. That was terrible. That was terrible. Kim finally touches the ball. I think that's the first time he's touched the ball all game. At least that I've seen. There we go. Get it. Get it to him. Nave. Oh, Treo. Nice shot, pal. Nice shot. Very good setup. Carthy to Pacheco. Now, Pacheco's a guy we still have our eye on for Team Canada. He still hasn't been chosen. He hasn't declared for the USA, and he's just, I believe he's just a couple of months away from being eligible. So I'm going to try to call him up as soon as, I should schedule a friendly, like, on the date that he can be called up. Just to make sure that I get him. Because he's very important to the next four years, without a doubt. We could have him next to Pascare and Feely. That'd be a, that'd be an excellent midfield. And then Sweeney backing them up. At, I mean, that's basically a Toronto FC. And as you can see, we we can win. We can win pretty much any league in the world. I mean, I think there's no doubt about that, except for the Mexican league because they kill us every every year. But maybe maybe this year will be our year in the Champions League. I got some confidence there. I think we've got a much better team than last season. Our guys are more experienced. Uh, get out of there. Good job. Got a better goaltender. I think we'll be fine. Fine, fine, fine. All right, let's make a sub here. Nave. Bring in uh, DiMaggio. And that's it. Treo, good save, buddy. Let's give it back to him. Give it back to him. He's open. He's open. There it is. Now cross it. You're wide open. Cross it. Now. Come on. Waited. He waited for it. Oh, Pacheco got the shot off. We're controlling. Um, we should probably drop back, I think. Our instructions a little bit. Go deeper, tighter marking, more discipline. Boop. And then we'll... I guess we'll bring our fullbacks back. Although DiMaggio isn't really a um, defensive fullback. He's more of an offensive fullback. Oh, Fisher almost. I don't know what he was doing there. I, don't, I wish he would get better at the advanced midfielder because that's pretty much what he has to play. I'm training him there. Um, and he's natural at that position. He just, it doesn't translate for some reason. He doesn't have all that years of experience playing there. Get there. Oh, Mahamadou got pushed off the ball. That's no good. All right, let's, there we go. Stunted that attack. Eduardo. Oh, 
Okay, that was some kind of weird turnover. Let's bring our fullbacks back. They're uh, just better in defense. Uh, is that it? No, we need to make some subs here. Uh, let's bring in Johnson for Chavez. That's basically an equal sub. And then Scott for McCarthy. Scott's a bit more of a defender. So he can play the ball winner. Defense. All right. We'll get defensive. That's fine. Don't want to embarrass these guys in their home stadium. We'll just take a nice little 2-0 victory. Uh, we might... Uh, no, they're staying back, I was going to say. I was going to crank up the uh, counter-attack, but they're staying back, so we'll just keep with our control action here. I mean, we still counter-attack mentality, but with control footing. I don't know what you'd call it, but it's our weird little design that we have. <sighs> okay. Coming up on 10 minutes to go. Well in control, well in control. So this, this bodes well, I think, for the Champions League. If we can, you know, pretty much dominate this team, I think we could... Beat a lot of teams in the Champions League. I wonder if Cruz Azul is going to be in it this year. Um, they weren't in it last year, and they win it quite a bit. He's offsides. No, he's not offsides. That's crazy. All right. Good play, Mamadou. Mamadou, Mamadou. Three, nothing. Crushing these fellas. I wonder if they've got their A team in or like are they playing? Did they take us lightly? That I don't know. I mean their team looked pretty good. The initial lineup there. Ooh, no 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 no. Nice. Was that just a whiff or did he stop it? I think Crow stopped it, yep. Good save, good save. Didn't have those kind of saves last year. What's going on here? All right. Just want to keep our shutout intact. One minute left of stoppage time. So it's an interesting game. Fairly, fairly dull affair here because they didn't put up any kind of resistance at all, especially in the second half. They just kind of let us control the match from beginning to end. So, are we that good? I don't know. Treo is still getting forward. He doesn't care what I tell him. He's an attacking fullback now, no matter what I say. <clears throat> Sweeney, he's good at uh, conducting the offense. Even from the anchorman position. Still like to get the ball back to him just to kind of reset, refocus. It's Pacheco been a good playmaker for us. And that should be time right there. There it is. Lovely, lovely 3 nothing victory. We should be pleased, and we are pleased. There we go. Everybody's happy. Let's look at these post-match stats. Chaco, eight key passes plus an assist. 9-0 rating. Treo, 9-0 rating. Nine tackles, five interceptions. And a goal. Man. Definitely dominated those guys. All right, so there you go. Friendly, not so friendly for them. Very friendly for us. See ya. Bye.